Hey gang, welcome back to Opaw's Diecast Restoration. Today we got the last of a group of cars that I found being thrown away by a lady one day. I did the Charger. I'm doing this one now. The Mustang went to Keith at Outlaw Speed Shop. And the GTO went to George at Hodges Hot Wheels. Before we get started, I'd like to remind you, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. These fun lines are just put together with screws. There isn't much to them. I'm assuming it came with a big goofy motor because the line was fun line and they were called the old cartoon pop the wheels off the base or clean up here it is all the pieces ready for restoration and custom work to our favorite stripper. For those of you wondering, the reason I always say shake it, shake it, don't break it, because one time I shook one up and the car was heavy enough it cracked the glass on the old jar. Here's the custom work. I'm going to cut out the doors and put in hinges so the doors function. This process was a little tougher because on uh, these fun lines, the casting is real thick. I'm going to fill up that area where that big gawking motor came out of. with some epoxy putty. Once it starts stiffening up a little, I'll cut it out cut it down. There's the hood made it up to it. Get our primer on. I'm not going to show you what color I painted it as I'm painting it. Leave that as a little surprise for the reveal. Wash up the tires and the craters. Get 
gets them ready to be re and shined up. Here's all the pieces ready for reassembly. This is what we started with, a fun line, cartoons series, 1956 Ford pickup. One of my favorites. Dirty, chipped up, missing the motor. Here's what we ended up with. Pearlized red. The custom end of it was movable doors, opening doors. And I went ahead and made them suicide doors. I always thought that would look really cool on a pickup truck. Hey, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I'd greatly appreciate it. Now, this is Opa in his 56 Ford pickup saying goodbye.